A smart battery charger, which works remotely and controls the level at which the device is charged at. A group of Ukrainians have said that they have greatly improved on this kind of technology. Every time there's a new technology coming out, there's always a bunch of skeptics saying that it's harmful or unrealistic, but people try it out and approve it later. And when the technology hits the market, all the skeptics are proven wrong. The team came up with the idea after becoming fed up with their phone batteries dying at the most inconvenient of moments. Our partner, Leszek Savitsky, was visiting us and he had another meeting at the airport. So his phone died and we couldn't find each other. And that's when we thought, well, wouldn't it be cool if we can solve this? The team spent almost four years working on the charger, along with teams from Poland, Uzbekistan and Germany. The first six months were tough. We were testing it over and over again, and the results were all negative. But we didn't give up and kept working at it. We had to perform more than 1,000 unsuccessful tests in order to get positive results. The Ukrainian developers weren't the first to create a wireless charger. When they started out, a so-called key charger was dominating the market. Now, but the Ukrainian team believes that that device is impractical. If you use a simple charger, you have a device and a cord. Meanwhile, the so-called wireless charger, you also need to carry this item. And you need to carry this receiver, which needs to connect to the phone. One of the main flaws of the wireless key device is that the phone which is charging can't be used. The Ukrainian team of inventors believe they have solved issues connected with that design. Their charger can be used with devices located within 10 meters. We take the phone and, there's our base, turn it on. You can manually adjust the range of charge in which you want the wireless charger to activate. For instance, you can set 28% as the activation threshold. When the charge drops below this level, the system will automatically activate and charge your phone up to 100%, for example. A wireless charger emits a certain amount of electromagnetic radiation which can affect a person's health. This is why the team took extra precautions when making their invention. I've been testing this for two years, and I underwent medical checks recently. Everything is within the norm. Now, the inventors are holding negotiations with potential investors. In 2019, their device will enter the market. At first, it will be sold as a base station and a special case for charging. In the future, the team plans to make the device more compact and install the receiver inside of phones.